Alright, hi everybody. Wow, it got cold. Just a few days ago it was in the upper 80s, 90 degrees, and it dipped down to 30. So, uh, but I still have a lot to do, and I definitely wanted to show you uh, what, I, what I found, uh, was it yesterday or day before? Uh, saw it on Craigslist, and it ha happened to be just a couple of blocks away from my house, but uh, went and picked up a bunch of mowers. There we go. That was the big haul for the day. And I already gave one of them away. I had eight of them. Uh, gave one away yesterday. And uh, But they all look pretty good. I got the cream of the crop, I guess. But there's one of the big craftsmen with the rear wheel drive. The seven horsepower. That's a big heavy mower there. There's another Craftsman 6.5. I've always liked these. I had one a long time ago that uh, it was a Craftsman. I think it was when the, it was the green, dark green color, a six horsepower. Uh, but it had the same. It was just the, the mower. It was just a push mower. had the 22 inch blade and these huge rear wheels. And I think mine actually still had the, the throttle control going back. But it's just a push mower, but man, it sure was handy. You know, you can just whip this thing around. And uh, so I was kind of glad to see that one. There's a Bolins, kind of the same. It's just a push mower. Uh, has a smaller engine, the 5, on it, but it has the big wheels. It's, it's easy to push around. Same thing with this one. Yard machines, real similar to the Bolins there. And, uh, but it's just a regular little push. Got a Toro and the GTS XL, and it's it's got to be an older one. It has that boxy looking blade. It kind of looks like a uh, a lawn boy, doesn't it? But uh, but it's in decent shape too. So the one I gave away was a Toro recycler, also a little newer one, but I already gave that away. We've got a couple of Hondas here. Uh, this one looks like the wheels are... This one's a little lopsided, but they're kind of worn out. But everything's on these. The, all the, the cables are good. Uh, I just need to test the engines and all that good stuff. But there's another Honda. Looks like it's in really good shape. Uh, and it's got the blade control and the throttle and the rear wheel drive. I like these Hondas. The engines are great and I like that quadra cut system they have on there. It really, really gives a really good cut. When you sharpen them down it's like like cutting on carpet, you know. But, uh, but yeah, so that was kind of unexpected. But uh, the guy must have had 20 plus mowers out there lined up on the street. And uh, I got the cream of the crop. Uh, there was a bunch left. A lot of guys showed up. I said, man, take them. <laughs> they thought I was going to take them all. I said, nah, I just want these right here. But uh, but that's great. I know it's an off-season, so I'll prob probably uh, just work on them sporadically until spring rolls around. But uh, unless somebody asks for one specific, then I'll, I'll fix it up for them. But it rained on them last night. I didn't have time to come out here and spread that tarp over. Uh, wow, yeah, the tarp came off my ATV too. But uh, this one, I'm just, you can see that front wheel's off. I'm just going to put a tube on it. Other than that, I've already done a lot of work on it, so I'm sure there'll be a video coming up. Uh, on that one also but that was the big haul on the street the other day yeah so that one kind of surprised me I wasn't expecting uh, I guess he was just cleaning out his backyard or whatever and uh, 
and uh, had a bunch of stuff. I think he said he's got a lot more. Um, what a couple of edgers and so I might pick those up too who knows but we'll see but yeah just thought I'd share and uh, just uh, thanks for watching for this quick video and be sure to subscribe and watch for my next videos